Finally, Friday night arrived, and the Coyotes began to answer critics that they had not played a schedule comparable to the E-Course season. The Coyotes built up a second quarter lead, but E-Course fought back, and both teams were trading baskets in an extremely tight game as the clock began to run out. The Coyotes suffered a big blow midway through the fourth quarter when 6-6 Bruce Jones threw his fifth foul. Coach Jerry Ernst sent in junior Scott Fredericks to replace Jones. Fredericks' only tournament action prior to the E-Course game had come in the Manistique blowout. The Coyotes missed crucial free throws, and E-Course had the upper hand. Down by one with less than a minute to go, the Coyotes got the ball back. Seconds ticked away. Who would take the last shot? Suddenly a scramble for the ball. A whistle, and with just three seconds left, Scott Fredericks would have a last chance to pull it out for Reed City with a one and one at the foul line. WBRN's Monty Dean was at Chrysler Arena. So Fredericks going to the line. The Coyotes are 26 and 0, and it all comes down to three seconds. They're watching in Hollywood because this is that kind of ending. John Frederick at the line, number 30. Bounces it three, four times, puts it up. And in! What a big free throw! Frederick plays the ball game with three seconds left! And another free throw would probably win it for the Coyotes. Frederick! 55, 55, Chrysler's going nuts, again, Scott Frederick, in it's up, one go, tie ball game, three, two, one, and we've got a whistle at the buzzer, let's see, it's a tie ball game, we're going to overtime, unless there's a free throw to be shot. still confusion, E-Course fans throwing things on the floor. And now it looks like Reed City's going to go to the free throw line with no time left. There was a foul with no time left just as it expired. And Chuck Conquest is going to go to the line. And the referee is saying a two-shot foul. Chuck Conquest can win the ballgame. Hold on. Chuck Holmquist is going to the line, that's for sure. Two-shot foul is not sure. Oh, man. What a ball game. 55-55. No time left on the clock. At the line is Holmquist. And Holmquist at the line. Two shots, he hits one, and Reed said he wins the ball game. Here's the four of the ball game. It's up. Won't go. Oh, no. He's got to hit the last one to win it, or else we go to overtime. Chuck Holmquist, a free throw for the basketball game. No time left on the clock. Tied 55-55. And here's Chuck, the 6'4 junior, for the basketball game. Puts it up. And the Coyotes win it! The Coyotes win it! 56-55! They're going to the final! Listen to the Reed City fans! 